Well, I finally just watched Frozen as at the 10th of May 2020, like literally six to seven years later. Like that's absolutely insane. So I, I think I read that it came out in November or December 2013 in New Zealand and that. And yeah, I can't believe I actually have watched it now. Because like, I think it sort of at the time it didn't really bother me in that. But then you just hear, River, like, I, I think there was about two songs in it that I didn't know. There was like the rock one, the ones with the rocks, and there was another one that I hadn't heard. But almost all of them, you just hear so many references, so much stuff all about it and that. It's like, it's just almost annoying because it's like, I'd rather just have watched the movie and just get all these memes and references. And, and it, it just became so big. It's like, man, you know, like just so popular, just all through the internet. It's like, I wish I watched it now. And I remember way back in, it must have been, I thought it was the, the, like, yeah, I thought it was, like, the, it was after the holidays in 2014, and then we all were asked, you know, what, what we did in the holidays, and anyway, one girl said that she's like, I had to watch Frozen twice, which I thought was, like, funny, like, you know, because at the time, you know, like, because I, even then, I'd sort of kind of wanted to see it in that, but, you know, and there's like, oh, I finally got to see it, although it's so, different seeing it, like, six years later and that, so it was like, man, I wish I watched it at the time and that, but, yeah, it was, like, yeah, it was, anyway, it was, it was, it was interesting, and hence, I thought, I thought that it had been after another holidays in that, because there's, like, we have the summer holidays, which goes, like, December, January, and then we go back to school at, like, the end of January, like, and then, but I had thought it would then, would had another holidays in that, and thus it was the, the, f like, not the main holidays, but the first, ter the t holidays after the first term that it was, but yeah, anyway, I thought it was a really well, well, well done movie in that, I, and, and I read Wikipedia afterwards, and man, did that movie, like, it was like 1930s, like, something, 1937 or something, they started work on the movie, kind of, like, as in, in a very brief way, like, Disney was sort of looking into it, that, and then it, it got scrapped, and then they had the war, and that, and were doing other stuff, and then after the war, they then, pardon me, they then, like, you know, and then there's just time after time, they, like, start doing it, and then scrap it, start doing it, scrap it, start doing it, and it's crazy to think it's finally come out, like, but, man, it was, like, and the whole Wikipedia was so long, I didn't read most of it in that, but, yeah, I just sort of was, like, well, because I just, I just finished watching it, like, at 4.40, and then read the Wikipedia for about five minutes and that, but, yeah, it was just, yeah, it was, it was a, yeah, it was a really well-made movie, I love Olaf's, o Olaf, you know, the snowman's personality is just great, I, th I think they all had great, you know, Anna and, you know, yeah, they, they just all had really good personalities in that. It was it was a really well-made movie in that. It's really, really solidly done in that. Yeah, I, I don't know. I just, I love it how, like, because it, it, I don't know, just, it just gives me, like, ideas in that. And I love it how, like, you know, like, you know, it's, it's like, really, like, you know, man, that would be, you know, like, you know, if, if that was on YouTube, you would have to mark that made for kids. But at the same time, I love it how it can still be thought provoking in that and, and you know just I don't know just different you know that like because well the thing is it's it's designed by adults in a sense but they so it's it's so weird because they have to kind of take into account what the kids you know would want to see in that and so they you know so I guess they probably consult with kids I don't know you know on how how to do it in that but it is directed primarily at kids in that but at the same time it's still sort of fascinating just seeing these sort of concepts and that and I really do think that those kind of you know you know those masses of those Disney movies Cars, Toy Story you know and Frozen and, and you know yesterday I watched Inside Out you know I reckon they really do have a solid good place in society I reckon that they just they just really I just like that like you know I think back to you know so you know like my happy childhood memories you know and you're know, thinking you know recalling Cars and watching Toy Story and that there are really nice memories in that you know and, and, and it's just it's just it gives, like, such a positive, awesome world, you know, just, it's just such a happy vibe, you know, such a happy place, you know, to think about it and all that, and just, yeah, and, and, it, like, yeah, it's, like, I still get stuff, probably if I watch Cars back or Shrek back, I'd probably get, you know, you know, be thought-provoking in a sense, like, you know, when I was then, you know, like, years ago, it's, like, it's just awesome, I just loved it for, for, you know, for it as a movie and that, but now I sort of, I can still enjoy it and appreciate it as a movie, although it's sadly not quite as much as when I was a kid, you know, like, when I was a kid, you know, be like, that was the best thing ever, it's, it's like, you know, it's like, oh, that was a good movie, you know, but not like, you know, whoa, okay, I don't know, I don't know, it's almost sad, like, it's sort of lost, you know, like, but at the same time, you know, lost the ability to be that, you know, have enjoyed it, you know, like, the movie that much or something, you know, but at the same time, I still enjoy it, and I still, you know, take, uh, sort of just take different stuff from it, like, you know, just think about different things and that, you know, and, and all that, but yeah, I, yeah, I, I really liked it, I think it was really well done, you know, 
Although it, it is like you know, like uh, and I don't, I don't really criticize movies in that. Although like it's like it, to me, it's like you know, because like it was just all this, you know, all because because they weren't like communicating at the start, and and you know, like as a, then it just caused all these problems in the whole, like all the problems of them going to the castle and then getting frozen and then having to go back and all that. Uh, you know, it's all because they didn't communicate at the start. So it's like if you just communicate at the start, none of this, you know, it's just like because they're just like like lacking communication in that, and so it's like, ah, oh, if that was fixed, you know, then you wouldn't have the movie, and that, uh, but yeah, it was, yeah, it was, there was that, uh, yeah, it was sort of, uh, yeah, watching it, it was, it wasn't anything like I expected, really, I don't know what I expected in that, I sort of, but I'd, I'd seen a few of the, the songs in that on YouTube and that, but it gave me a totally different idea of what the movie would be like, like, it was different, but I, I feel like it would be no matter what, I don't feel like I have... A way that I think it would be, in a sense, and so, whatever it is, it's like, oh yeah, I didn't expect that, kind of thing, but, yeah, it was, yeah, it was, yeah, because it was, what was the, oh yeah, yeah, because the guy that, that wrote it, I didn't realise, he's, he's written the book there, The Ugly Duckling and that, and it's so weird, because it's like, what the heck, like, because it, uh, it's like the, the Snow Queen, he wrote the book, like, The Snow Queen and that, or the poem, or what, whatever it was, that then turned into Frozen eventually, but it's kind of weird, because it's like, the, this dude's literature, because I, I like when I was a kid, I was read the book called The Ugly Duckling, as well as a few other ones in that, you know, these sh these short little books, and, it, and it's, it's weird, because it's like, this is the same mind, the guy, well, in a sense, although there's been so much additional input into the movie, you know, in, into the Frozen movie and that, but it's kind of weird that the same guy, the same mind behind, you know, The Ugly Duckling, also is kind of, like, I, I don't know what percentage responsible, but, you know, he's he's the, the mastermind behind the, the movie Frozen, you know, The Snow Queen turned into Frozen, you know, with the massive amount of help, you know, by all the other experts, it was like, wow, like, I've been exposed to the same guy who came up with Frozen, you know, years ago, with his his other ideas and that, you know, via the Ugly Duckling and stuff like that, and, and, and I, th oh, no, no, the Little Mermaid, no, I'm, I'm not sure if that was him or not, but yeah, anyway, it's, I, 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 I don't know, I like watching movies sort of when they come out, which is kind of silly, because it's like, well, the movies before I bought, was it before I was born, do I not like watching them, it's like, Oh, you're true. You know, but it's like, I don't know, because it's like, when I watch a movie, it's like, I wish I sort of watched it as it came out, and so then you sort of, from that point on, you sort of, like, see all the, the, the stuff, the articles about it, the memes about it, whatnot, and that. But yeah, I, I really, really enjoyed it. I thought it was good. You know? I thought it was good. Yeah, because I sort of, yeah, I don't really watch any movies really at all, but since I've had the collapsed lung, I've sort of just, like, been doing less YouTube stuff. And instead, you know, relaxing. And also, I had frozen berries while I ate it. So, yeah, there we go. That was a snack of choice. Frozen berries for the movie Frozen. Yeah, everything just got frozen in the movie Frozen. I didn't really think that that was going to happen. But anyway, it was it was a really good movie. So, yeah, that's going to wrap up this video. And that was sort of just the main things I want to say about it. I always love watching movies. Even though I hardly ever watch movies, I still enjoy it when I do. So, yeah, have a wonderful, beautiful rest of your day. And, yeah, see you next time. Goodbye for now.